Trump makes shock MS-13 announcement. President Donald Trump is never shy when it comes to saying what he wants to get done. Perhaps even better, he is not shy when it comes time to turn those words into actions. Gang violence is a growing problem in the United States. Rather, it was a growing problem. President Donald Trump recently tweeted in response to an article published by The Hill explaining the latest MS-13 crackdown. Together, we're going to restore safety to our streets and peace to our communities, and we're going to destroy the vile criminal cartel hash M.S. 13, and many other gangs. The president's tweet reads. MS-13 is a gang consisting of mostly illegal Hispanic individuals who know no bounds when it comes to violent acts. The Hill reports that hundreds of people are being arrested in connection with the gang. President Trump gave a speech a couple of months ago explaining his plan to crack down on MS-13. The gang is known for going into neighborhoods with lower-class individuals or illegal immigrants and essentially terrorizing them. It is the policy of this administration to dismantle, decimate, and eradicate MS-13, President Trump said during the speech. He went on to connect the gang of mostly illegals to the immigration policy of the United States, which was barely being enforced, it seemed, under former President Obama. The Deputy Director of Immigration and Customs Enforcement ICE, Tom Homan, and the Deputy Assistant Attorney General for the Department of Justice's Criminal Division David Rybitsky, are scheduled to explain the progress their operations have made in dismantling the gang in the United States. President Trump's cabinet seems to all be on the same page. Attorney General Jeff Sessions said last month that MS-13 is a priority for his department. The Organized Crime Drug Enforcement Task Forces are currently looking into ways to infiltrate and bring the gang down. The goal, of course, is to secure the safety of the American people. Now they will go after MS-13 with a renewed vigor and a sharpened focus. I am announcing that I have authorized them to use every lawful tool to investigate MS-13, not just our drug laws, but everything from RICA to our tax laws to our firearms laws. Attorney General Sessions stated. Sessions went on to compare Al Capone's elimination through the tax laws to the laws that they are going to use to get MS-13 out of the United States. This is a bold and ambitious move for the Trump administration, especially considering the speed with which MS-13 has grown in the United States. Homan said that he has been able to detain more people under President Trump's administration due to the way the president takes illegal immigration seriously. He went on to explain that the people who work underneath him have a tough job, and perhaps don't get the recognition they deserve, considering their dangerous work. These are men and women who do their job honorably. They get up every morning, strap a gun to their hip and leave the safety of their homes and their families to protect communities, to protect people they'll never meet, and they'll never know," Homan said. Oman said.